this is it. That's it when it's it. As you can see, it is a gorgeous day today. I took the day off because I need to get a little jump start going here. It's taken me too long to get this kitchen area done because of the electric. This main room is just a mess and it's driving me crazy. Now, I know the answer is to get the work done because when I get the work done, these cabinets become part of the wall and get built in. And all these wires that I got laid out here also become part of the house. We have planned for some time that we were going to have the power come out and down. So there's gonna be a box right there where that wire comes out, those join together and comes down. There was a natural gap in the back of the, of the ceiling that allowed me to run the wire like that so it's mostly hidden as it comes across. Here, I didn't have that, so I put the strut up there to hold the wire. I'm gonna use that to carry the wire across. I've got two pieces that I need to take all, all the way across. One of them provides the electricity for this wall, and the other one connects all of my smoke detectors on one side of the house to the other side of the house so they're all on the same circuit. I've measured everything, I've cut everything. I'm getting ready to go ahead and drill a couple of holes right here to run those two lines into the attic where I'm gonna connect them into the electrical system and start feeding them across. I'm guessing that my description didn't make any sense at all and hopefully as I do it, it'll start making more sense. list of things that I didn't know but should have when building this house is quite extensive. I'm including all these things because I know that some of you will be taking on your own home build or remodel someday and if you can learn what not to do from what I did wrong then you got your money's worth. I put in a conduit to carry the electricity from one side of the house to the other but it was undersized and the wire size required to power a 100 amp sub panel across the house was much larger and much more inflexible than I thought. I hired an electrician to install the conduit across the top of the main room and fortunately our original industrial farmhouse concept works well with the look. Adding the metal flex cable on strut looks a lot like the wiring that you find in many of the repurposed old warehouses in our area. Ooh, shucks, I almost fell. If we hadn't been comfortable with this look, we would have dug a trench behind the house and put that in to achieve the transition from the main panel to the sub panel but the MX cable still would have been necessary and having the two next to each other just seems to complement very well. <laughs> Japana and I debated on painting the strut and wire white. I gave in and now that I see it up there, I like the way it looks. I don't think that I could have planned this out any better if I'd intended it from the start.
fold this in as well. I have room to bring in some more if I need this box, but for right now that box is done. farm sink that I started putting in the other day still needs some adjustment. As I said previously, the key is to take your time. The sink weighs over a hundred pounds, and while that wouldn't be much for half the Bornson, I'm getting a little long in the tooth, and my feats of strength days are behind me mostly. Having Jafana there to help me keep things steady made things go a lot faster, even if they didn't really go all that fast. As you might imagine, we're starting to feel a little builder's fatigue. That's when teamwork is even more important. So over here in the darkness, Lauren is feeling well enough to travel up and sit by the fire. And smile even. I know that Jafana wants to go home, and Apollo wants to go home, and if the truth be told, I want to go home too. But if we don't power through a few of these things and put them to bed, they're never going to get done, and we're never going to get moved in. Love you. Thanks. Love you. <laughs> Everyone's asking about you. Are you alive? <laughs> took, I, took everything out of you to come up here? Well, my battery died. Well, but Lauren is doing very well. She and Jafana are heading home because it's getting late. And I'm going to stick around a little bit and start to work on the corner cabinet. There we go. All four are in. Let's 
the way we want it. I am nowhere near being done. Certainly didn't uh, didn't achieve what I wanted to, but I pushed the ball forward a little bit. It is getting close to midnight. I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna come back in two days and I'm gonna do it again. We'll see you guys next time.